Oh, Ooh, got it. I'm trying. How in the heck is it going, everybody? Super stoked to bring you this video. So we're gonna keep this intro here rather short. This video was filmed, Keweenaw Bay, Upper Peninsula of Michigan. Um, probably one of the biggest, definitely one of the biggest fish of the season. First of that species, longest fight by far of the season. Uh, stoked, had a couple buddies come up. Oh, what's up, cat? Come up from uh, downstate this, where we, well, they don't have any ice down there. Everything's wide open and we still have like three feet. Winter will just not leave, which is okay. You know, I love to ice fish, but I'm ready to get into the boat, get some different camera angles, start bringing you guys some better videos. But, but I'll just say, we will recap this video at the end. Thank you for your support. Thank you for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And here is the video. Getting all geared up, trying some new waters, queuing all bay. See what'll happen. Is it a smell? He's a good one. It's, it's not a smell. smell. It's for sure a smell. Yeah, it's a smell. I think it's a, one of those hybrid smelt cohos. It's a master smell. Smell. Smell held. Well, light tackle, four pound test. Four pound test. Well, guys catch eight pound steelhead on, on Snoopy poles, so you got. This. That's oh, that's not all right. That's not the one you got your deucer in. Good. How far is your deucer below the ice? Like an inch. You're gaining. I'm gonna pull it just to be safe for you. Yep. Pull mine too, Brad, would you? Yep. I am so aroused right now. Oh, yeah. God, I'm I was just gonna move too. What did you catch on the minnow? Right on the minnow. I was just about to come over here and have you tie a Swedish pimple on me. I wonder how long we was on for. Yeah, it's a burb. It, it's, prob it's probably an issue. <laughs> they do. I have heard people bullshit. catching burbs out here during the day. That's pulling. <clears throat> Thirty-six it's a, inch ultralight. It's 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 all ice blue. It's... <laughs> Good thing you got four pound test. Yeah. Should have been here yesterday. Gonna there keep him go. off. No, he's oh, good. don't horse him now. No, he's coming though. Yeah, he's good. You're good. Talk dirty yeah. to him. No, talk kind, sweet words. Whisper sweet nothings I in his ear. I want to see your face, please. Brad's gonna lose him at the hole. I wanna meet you. I don't want Brad no, to grab him. Let me be honest with you. <laughs> I've, Brad, I've, gets, I've, Brad I've, gets excited. I've improved my netting skills greatly in the river, so. <laughs> oh my first. God! Get him! Uh, if you guys want, I can grab that line right now and just <laughs> just hand line him in. Yeah, right about now. Laker. Could what be. You guys guess this. I think it's a brown. I'm guessing steelhead. I'm guessing, head. um... If it's a steelhead, I will, I will shooty poop on the ice and I'll eat it with ice. I'm gonna say red-eared sunfish. <laughs> oh my god, it's a warm mouth. <laughs> snakehead, for sure. It's definitely a bullseye snakehead. Oh, you're getting, he's done. Don't say that, don't say that. It's definitely not... Yeah, he's done, yeah. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and say definitely not a coho. It's not a coho. <laughs> it's pumping its head like crazy, mother... A brown. I hope it's a big old brown. I can't this wait to cut all the actually... F words out of my video. <laughs> oh, sorry. I thought you forgot your. Oh, yeah. I didn't know your GoPro was on. <laughs> sorry. F potty mouth. Yeah. It's a giant, if, dude. If you fish with me, you're not going to get much footage. No. <laughs> no. I had a buddy that I duck on with that's like that. There you go. Give your rod tip up. Don't forget to mend it. Don't forget to mend it. I'm going to let him run. He's not done yet. Ooh. It could be a sturgeon. It's not a sturgeon. It's a sturgeon. I don't know. It's not a sturgeon. <laughs> My rod's probably down the hole already. <laughs> yeah. Was that just on a treble? Yeah. Right in the lips. Just a tiny little treble. Just a number 14 treble. <laughs> <laughs> like a crappie rig, basically. Could be a big crappie. Yeah, it could be a giant crappie. <laughs> I heard the perch out here just really hit Probably a 30 inch smallmouth, honest to God. Probably. <laughs> 35, Maybe I seven bet. 7 pound smallie. I'd eat the bricks if it was, I'd bricks if it was 7 pound smallie. I'd kidding. eat the brick you shat yeah. if it was a... <laughs> There you go. Yeah, but like everything I'm gaining back is what he just took from me. Yeah. He's about to take the it The only down. thing is, at least it's only 25 <clears> foot of water. 
water. You're not talking your 100 foot down. Oh, whoa. Can you see He's him? He's giant. Oh, God. It's fucking, it? I don't know, it's huge. Oh, God. It's huge. Don't don't stop taker. talking. Oh. Stop talking. Oh, 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 he's right at the hole. Hang on, hang on. Don't touch the line. Not, he's 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 this much bigger than the <laughs> hole. Don't touch the line. <laughs> Should we pull the shanty over the top? Flip the shanty over. So we got better we angle. Flip it backwards this way. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we hold it right here. Eight. Oh, that's all right. The four people around us. Our silver, big silver. Not a car. I know. I'm you, when you were, I didn't want to touch the line, but you were pulling on him, and his, his head was, was here, and his tail was here, and his back we just gotta, we just gotta get across him. the... We just gotta wait till he's ready with yep. his head. I don't want to horse him. Take your time. I wish we had a gaff. I know, we could have, we should have brought him. I, yeah. I should have brought it. I should have brought the spear gun. Something. <laughs> this is a safe zone. No, there's no bad ideas. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I'm gonna... 36 inch I'm, I'm telling you, it's, I'm going to tell you what, I'm every, done with my, uh, done with my bluegill rods. It's every bit of 30, 35 inches. I'm putting that orange pimple on that freaking my rod. burbot rod and I'm jigging a minner. There's got to be another place to get bait if we run out of minnows. I'll steal from one of them shanties. But I oh, bet. There? I guarantee. I can find all. There's actually a sporting goods store. It's right there. closed on Sundays, which is ridiculous. This morning. So we've got a dozen shiners and about. No stuff in a hole. <laughs> I, I, I already got I'm that covered today. If you guys are hitting those. Yeah, and if anything, we'll go get some smelt tails. Oh, oh got it. I'm telling you, it's a sturge. It's not a sturge. Sturgeons is a herpes of ice fishing. I'll tell you, it's probably more than four pounds. I would guess. It, it's more than four pounds. It's like a seven or eight pound fish, at least. Dead stick in the middle. Literally in a rod holder. I don't think he was on there that long, though, because the rod tip was just like doing this. When, when you said no, something, you like, I'm like, like yeah, like working. you got a lot of marks on your graph, or yeah, you got a fish. No, like there's a fish on the rod. Like I picked it up and set the hook, and it was just like. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what was it like? <laughs> I've seen that before. I've heard about it. Yeah. My dad told me stories growing up. When you get a big one, they go. That's, that's what, what it do. was like. Yeah. Jesus. Get this thing out of my way. Now he's angry. <laughs> oh my god. You put that I'm telling you. That, <laughs> Probably a king. The guy was a creel survey guy. Was just saying he was surprised he hasn't seen any kings yet. Well, he should have checked us later. <laughs> Yeah, first time out here, we got a 42 inch king. <laughs> about, about 39 and a half pounds. Could be a muskie. I mean, it was right at the hole, but I was trying not to, I didn't want to get over his rod. And... Peacock bass, he, maybe? I think he was pretty like a yeah, tiger I fish. The, I heard the peacocks are really I, I wasn't kidding about those Lakes Pier Goliath groupers. Are you told him about that, Scott? You're going to kneel in that hole now. Oh, I'm good. He already fell in it once. <laughs> if I do a pencil, I'll end up at the bottom. Alright, when if if he comes through the hole, don't be grabbing at the line. Grab Wait till you can get his gills and get some fingers in his gills. Whatever you gotta do, but you don't grab the line, it? please. <laughs> Scott. <laughs> Just thinking about what this fish is gonna be. Mallards in the background. Brad, we need to turn your medium action rod with the six pound on it yeah. into the metal rod, I think. Yeah, with the fluorocarbon. Yeah, because this is just. Fluoro braid. I'm going, yeah, five, got, I'm going my 15 pound braid. I got braid. 10 pound braid on I one and six pound fluoro on the other. Oh, there he is right here. He's at the hole. Okay, where's he's, his head? He's upside down. His head's over here. Hang on, right there. Up. Pull, 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 pull. Get him, Scott. It's a white fish. It's a white fish. A giant white fish. Get him. Get him. Stop. Watch, 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 watch. Stop. Watch, watch your hands. Stop. <laughs> get get him. him. Somebody get him. <laughs> yeah, his Somebody gills are so small. Get him. Woo! Holy that's a big white fish. That's a giant whitey. Damn, that is not what I expected. <laughs> On a scale of one to ten. I no told you he had like <laughs> Woo! All right, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for watching.
you're probably wondering why the audio was cutting out. We were out with uh, some potty mouse, so Ryan and Brad, good guys, but uh, they got excited. It's all good. It's all good. Just takes longer to edit when you have to cut out 700 swear words, which is no big deal. You know, if everybody gets excited, we are all human. The end of that video is hilarious. The whole time we were uh, bashing on Brad, the shorter guy, because uh, I guess he wasn't very good at landing fish. And then you saw me make a fool of myself at the end. I was trying to grab underneath the white fish's gills, which, as you just saw, did, did not work very well. But we landed the fish, um, caught a bunch more fish that day, which you will see in a later video. Didn't want to make a 20 minute video. We'll keep this one rather short. And unfortunately I have to do homework. I procrastinated my homework a little long. Gary Vee's new book just came out. So I've been listening to that and made this video. So I should probably get to some homework. Only got a month of school left. Then I'm graduated and then it is, uh, it's game on. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you for your support. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever you're feeling, leave a comment. We love talking with you guys. Tell a friend to subscribe. Next giveaway is, uh, well, our next big giveaway is at 7500 but we just announced a bonus giveaway at $6,000. we are giving away 20 Hunters for Life packages. So, uh, I don't know. We just like giving back to you guys. Uh, you know, you guys help us get our name out there. So, the least we can do is give you guys free stuff. So, leave a comment that enters you for the giveaway. That's about all I got to ramble on about. Thank you for your support. As always, happy it.